Ah, the weekend. A time to sit back, sleep in, relax, and then get called into work because there's an emergency. But regardless, it is the weekend, and that is good. But that also means that I need to have a new video out, and I kind of haven't worked on anything else, so what can I do quickly? Well, spring season is almost over, and I'm behind on literally everything, but let's not worry about that now, and instead look to the summer to see what sort of wonderful shows will be airing. At least I hope they're wonderful. We'll see. It's actually not that exciting of a season, at least not compared to spring, but that's not a bad thing, so I can actually get caught up. Probably not. Whatever. Anyway, on with the list. First, we have Attack on Titan Season 3. Attack on Titan is what got me into seasonal anime, and I really like Season 2, even though I was afraid I might not all that much. But yeah, I'm excited for Season 3, especially since I think it's supposed to be two core, so that will be good, so I'll get hopefully like a lot of the story, maybe all of it. I don't know how close it is to its end. I have heard that we get more into the politics thing here, which is not as exciting, but I'm still interested to see that because I'm want to see like what's going on with the world as a whole beyond just what we see from the main characters. So yeah, here's hoping it will be as good as the other two seasons. Next is FLCL Alternative, which I think has already started, but it will mostly air in the summer, so I'm going to count that for this video. The original FLCL was weird and imaginative and just bizarre, so I'm pretty sure that I will like the continuation here. When the first episode of Progressive aired back in April, I wasn't a huge fan of it, though I did end up liking it once Haruka showed up. It may not live up to the first season, but if I expect something weird and fun to watch, I don't think I will be disappointed with more FLCO. Okay, so that was two big names, so let's look for some non-sequels so that I'm not just another mainstream anime fan who only talks about the popular stuff. So for number three, let's go with it. Tenru Cyrus the Jaeger. This is an action supernatural show about a group of vampire hunters who carry musical instruments. This sounds weird, which is a good thing, so I'm hoping this will be like ridiculous, absurd, and or just plain awesome. Granted, I am a bit worried since this is PA Works and they seem to be overly ambitious with their shows, and other than Angel Beats, I haven't liked anything from them, so we'll see. I doubt it will be mediocre though, so I think that's a good thing. And for number four, let's go with Planet Wish which I really don't know much about, except it is from the manga who wrote Lucifer and the Biscuit Hammer, which I want to read, and it is by the director who directed Hentai Prince and the Stony Cat, which I want to watch. So if I watch this, I kind of get both those checked off, though I, I... Yeah, we'll say it works that way. It's also an original mech anime, which is something different, so yeah, it could be good. Some of my favorite shows have been original mech anime, or it'll just be something bad and me mediocre. We'll see. It's worth a try, though, I think. And moving even further into the shows that no one is talking about so far, we have Angu Genius Dolls. It's about this conflict between seamstresses and saviors, and the trailer just looks really cool. Maybe it's because I've been watching Kill a Kill lately, and there's like seamstresses and clothes and all that there, so it kind of reminds me of that. But this one I think will be a bit darker with it being a horror manga, so hopefully that's good. I'm not always a big fan of horror, so we'll see how this goes. But this is another one. It won't be ordinary. I think. I hope. Come on, the trailer had awesome music and looked cool. That has to say something about the show. So yeah, that's my five anime from the summer I'm looking forward to, and let me know which ones you're looking forward to that I missed so I can be sure to check them out and then like it and then put it on hold until like January. Because that's how I tend to do things. Anyway, thanks for watching, and I will see you all next time.